think as everyone tries to figure out how to jailbreak models, that's a continuing problem. So yeah. Any piece of technology, if you put it in front of human beings, they're going to find out how to push the edges. And particularly if you're going to use these in environments where you've got, let's just say, students or mm -hmm. others, there's got a lot of free time. They're going to figure out how to get it to do whatever you tell it not to. And this info flood paper was super interesting because the approach was really to use more verbose prompts mm -hmm. is the term I'll use. It. You know, I was joking with Sarab that you basically you create your prompt in consultanese and you don't speak straightly and mm -hmm. that broke a lot of the models out there. I can see how it happens because they have limited context window, each of the yeah. model does. If you fill up the context with something more authoritative and more important kind of sounding message, they may tend to forget some of the system prompts and the boundaries that have been put in place. And I think probably we should level set first is when we talk about that context window, right? When you think about an LLM, you have a system prompt and you have what's been trained into the neural networks. And that's what you're talking about for that context window. Right. That all takes pieces of that out. And if you break beyond it, then it forgets whatever you told it not to do.